Oh, yeah. Uh, for some reason, game audio didn't work for the first half of the recording. So uh, I have decided to do my own Minecraft sound effects. Cluck, cluck, cluck. Melons, 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 melons. This won't get annoying at all. <laughs> Minecraft, back again. Yeah, I'm something of a Minecraft YouTuber myself. Uh, we killed the Ender Dragon last episode. We are now Minecraft expert pro legends. The world is free. My melons are free to grow to maximum capacities. Honestly, since like the first six episodes was working towards the Ender Dragon, like I kind of do feel free now. Like I c it's a sandbox. Like just take a look at this. I've, I've changed my base a little bit. I'll explain it all in a second. Um, Alex found my horse. Yeah, the pumpkin god himself found my horse, Bar Bartholomew. Uh, I thought he died in episode five, but no, Alex found him. I'm still going to destroy you. Whack, 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 whack. Yeah, um, I mean, Fresh's horse, yes, did die last episode. I don't think I showed it, but at least we got Bartholomew back. Chicken, what are you do- I'm having chicken tonight. Chicken tonight. But I'm not actually, because I'm a vegan. I don't eat the chicken. I will throw this in the river and it'll go back to nature. I don't know how that chicken escaped, but um, yeah, I'm I'm making a zoo. Like I built a chicken zoo. Cluck, cluck, boys, what's up? Guys, I'm a vegan. Uh, we don't hurt animals, but I will stick them in a cage and look at them and, and stare at their sad little faces. I put the front entrance uh, here now with some iron doors. Um, you know, everything's still the same in here. This is- this is my secret experimenta- experimentating lair. Uh, this is where I do all my secret experiments. Cause I'm like trying to learn how to do lots of cool farms and stuff. Uh, so here's my automatic fisher. I got my fishing rod up there that I use. You know, this is where I get all my enchanted books and stuff. You've seen that, but I kind of cleaned it up a little bit. And then this, boys. You know I love my melons. And you know on my adventures, I get a little bit stinky. I've, uh, I've made myself a watermelon shower. So now I can clean myself with the beautiful scent of watermelons. Not only do I eat them, now I will smell like them. Oh yeah, shower me with melons. You can't really see it, but I'm being showered with melons right now. It's like, it's like standing here in the melons clean you up real good. I mean, it's also just like a really easy way to get a lot of melons to eat. <laughs> Alright, I'm nice and clean. I smell like melons now. It's like a big automatic redstone melon shower. I uh, know, I watched like some random tutorial. I spent like four hours watching Minecraft tutorials and I used that knowledge to invent a watermelon shower. Ah, uh, it gets cooler though, right? So you're thinking eventually you're gonna run out of watermelons, you know? But no. Um, this is an automatic melon farm. So every time the melon grows up, it harvests it and it goes down those hoppers. They lead to me melon shower. So I'll never run out of melons. And even if you do run out of melons, you just pop on over here Harvest yourself some melons, you know, and you can uh, you can refill your shower. Now you'll always smell like the beautiful scent of melon. I uh, know. Join me next week where I make a toilet. I'm not joking. I'm trying to figure out how to make a toilet. Okay, I got some. I got something I want to do. Like we're gonna we're gonna do some really cool stuff this episode. But like something like see how there's one melon thing there. I kind of want to cover the whole thing in melons, but I need leather. So welcome to my favorite vegan segment. Uh, whacking animals with uh, my sword. Ah ah ah. I'm trying to ride Bartholomew. What the hell is this? This thing's grabbing onto me. What the hell is that? I didn't build that. Alex must have built that. Stop it. Stop it. Violence fixes everything. All right, I gotta go do my favorite vegan segment and get some leather. I grew up, uh, I spent a lot of time on a farm as a kid. I know exactly how to do this. Ah, uh, yeet! Yeet! That's exactly what my dad used to say when he led him onto the truck to send him to McDonald's. And we got our first bit of leather. I think we only need like nine leather or something. Yeah, I already got three leather. This will be- I'll be done in no time. Oh, actually, I need to kill creepers. I need to kill creepers for gunpowder. Oh, I'm a creeper. Oh, man. Easy claps, easy claps. Alright, easy. I'm almost dead, but that was easy. Ah, I got 11. That's almost enough. Ah, uh, <laughs> this is what- this is what I needed all that leather for. This is what all those cows died for, this absolutely worthy cause. They all died for such an honorable, worthy sacrifice to, uh... Well, I, gotta, I gotta turn that the right way. They all died for such a beautiful, worthy cause. My, uh, my melon shower. Now it looks good. Oh, yeah, you know, I'm starting to smell after all that cow murder. Oh, yeah, shower me. Shower me. Yeah, I reckon it's looking good. That looks like a... I've never seen a better looking melon shower. All right, so I want to do something real cool with TNT. Uh, I want to make something that like auto drills with TNT. It's sick. I need a lot of slime for it, which I don't have any slime. Uh, I've got to go kill giant slimes for that. I want to go do that. Apparently they spawn in swamps. Yeah, there's a swamp. 
There's a swamp. You don't want a swamp that's too hilly, though. You want, like, a nice, flat swamp. Nah, this is going to be the swamp we need. There's going to be some slime spawn in this place for sure. Did I just discover a new village while waiting for some slimes? I think we have the worst... Like, apparently slimes only come out when there's a moon. I don't think we got a moon tonight. Of course, the one night I go looking for slime... Oh, my God. This bow is so powerful. Holy crap. I just deleted two creepers. I need their gunpowder. Come here. I gotta make stuff blow up. Yeah, boy. Yeah, while well, I wait for the slimy boys, what do you guys trade? You've got a mason. Okay. Yeah, how much wheat for an emerald? 20 wheat? All right, easy. Watch this. Watch this right here. This is some stoinks right here. Watch this stoinks. Watch these stoinks. Hey, buddy. What's up? Thanks for the emerald. <laughs> yeah, people ask me, like, Laser Beam, is it hard being this smart? You know what? You know what I say to them? Yes. Yes, it is. It is so hard having this huge of a brain. Imagine being a farmer, getting all your wheat stolen, and then having to buy it back for emeralds. Look at all these stoinks. I've got four emeralds. You're so dumb. Oh, look, there's more. <laughs> my stoinks levels is just skyrocketings. Nah, see, this is why I want to build uh, my own villager uh, colony, though. Because I can have a bunch of uh, villagers near me that have very favorable trade options. And I can play, like, the villager stock market and get tons of emeralds. And you can get, actually, like, some super, like, super powerful power-ups and stuff. Look at all my emeralds, dude. Yo, this is unfair. I kind of feel bad for him because he's kind of so dumb. But, um, you know, that's, he's playing... He's, you know, that's, that's that's the way the game's played, dude. Bro, 14 emeralds. Oh, they're also a village based on a melon diet. And it's weird that they can be based on a melon diet, but be so stupid. Ah, uh, yes, I would like to propose another trade with you, my good man. Don't worry, I won't rip you off. Oh, now he's selling them for 43. Yeah, that's a pretty steep price. But, like, considering I got this wheat for free, I actually... I don't really mind. After 16 emeralds, he's finally stopped accepting my offers. Oh, I think I, that's what... That's a slime. This is our first slime. Okay, I've been waiting. Boy, I wonder how many slime slime blobs they give me. Wait, how powerful? Ow! How powerful? Is, okay, that was easy. Nope. Oh! <laughs> That's easy, he says, as like four more of his babies jump out at me. You best give me some good blobs of slime, you little rats. Give me good slime blobs. Well, they actually give you a lot of slime blobs. This might not take as long as I thought. Holy crap. Now they give you tons of slime blobs. This looks like a little baby slime, but hopefully it gives me some uh, slime balls. I don't care if it's a baby slime. They still, as long as you give me slime balls. Oh yeah, we, li we live in good. 17. This won't take as long as I thought. Yes! Yes! This is so good. It might only take us like two nights to get this done. Oh, this is a big boy too. Oh, I don't care how many babies you got. I eat babies before, mate. I eat babies. Look at this baby zombie. I'll I'm lagging real hard right now. Girlfriend's watching Netflix. You know what? I play Minecraft and I've got a girlfriend. Coincidence? I don't think so. Play Minecraft, you get a girlfriend. And you also get lots of slime balls. Slap them. Give me those slime balls. Give me them slime balls. Yes! This is everything I've ever dreamed of. This is everything I've ever dreamed of. It is like a school excursion of slimes. And I'm just slicing through them. This is my prize after killing the ender dragon. Look at that. Oh, it's so good. Wow, I'm, already, I'm already, holy crap, I'm always at 60 already. Holy crap, there is suddenly so many slimes. Why is there so many? Well, I ended up with uh, 84 slime balls and 17 emeralds from that village. I think if I've done my maths right, which is very possible I haven't, I think 84 is heaps. What the hell is that? I've never seen that before. This, this looks like a giant chest. This is something Alex has built, 100%. What's in it? What's in it? Okay. Is it booby trapped? the hell? A slime spawn egg, a cake, a turtle egg. What the hell is that doing? <laughs> I don't know if this is part of like Alex's weird plans. Like obviously I can't use any of this because that's cheating. But like why would Alex build a giant chest looking thing and put another chest inside it? What kind of chestception? It's so deep. There's so many layers. It's like an onion, you know? It's like an ogre. I don't want none of this contraband. That's illegal. That goes against all the Minecraft ethic codes. That's illegal right there. I'm not taking it. Alex is Alex is the weirdest god I have ever seen. Who who just makes that? It just doesn't make sense. Oh, it's good to be back at the dong. Yes. I love dong. Still haven't eaten any of you, so I'm still vegan. Okay, we can make nine slime blocks. That hope hopefully that's enough. Ah, guess what the beam forgot? The beam forgot he needs coral. Now you might be thinking. What could Coral and TNT possibly have to do with each other? Well, that's for, for dumb 
dumb scientist to figure out and for you, for you to watch and learn. I mean, I for one have absolutely no idea where coral grows. Um, so that's a rough start. Um, yeah, I see a lot of seaweed. Yeah, I'm not seeing the coral. I'm, I'm not seeing any. I'm like a dolphin. All right, let's keep, like, like it's gotta look, the coral's gotta look like a different biome. So let's just keep going until we see that. What was that? <laughs> nah, none of this is, nah, none of this is okay. My brain was not ready for what I just saw. There's spooky fish god people after me. Aquaman's after me. I don't know if like, I don't know if this is gonna offend anyone, but the entire ocean looks the same to me. So I'm not really seeing where I'm supposed to find this coral. Oh my god, this is a coral reef. It's so beautiful. Look at it, it's gorgeous. You tell me it drops nothing? Where's my coral? Um, so according to Wikipedia, you can't harvest coral unless you have a silk touch enchanted item. Why didn't I read that before? Apparently need silk touch pickaxe for that. I don't have one. I literally can't build my TNT without this. I'm gonna take down those coordinates and I'll be back when I can get the silk touch enchantment. I got 53 levels. Surely if I put enough tools in here, I might get like silk touch from one of them. Bloody hell. Nick Minute. Oh my god! Oh, yes. Oh, my God. I I've literally enchanted almost all my stuff. Oh, we got a silk touch one. Oh, that's all we need. It, it can be a diamond shovel, I'm pretty sure. I don't think it matters. Oh, my God. Oh, this better work. This better work. Otherwise, I'm uninstalling Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally, I have tears in my eyes over it. some sea plant. Well, I'm going to get a bunch of it just in case I need some extra. You know, I'm not going to risk it. We have to put a lot of work in to make the, the world explode, but we're going to appreciate it. You know, we're going to appreciate it. I'm not joking. It takes 15 minutes to get home. All right, well, finally, after adventuring to a different climate and getting some sea plants, we can build some exploding world bombs. You'll see. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep building all the stuff I need to build. Shouldn't take long. All right, where do we want to have a giant TNT duplicator dropper uh, extraordinaire thing? I say we put it here. Now, we've got to go up a little bit. Get our slime blocks. Oh, I'm watching a tutorial right now. No, just honestly, just sit back and appreciate intelligence like you've never seen it. Took me an hour to get that coral. That's all I needed it for. That was worth it. Think if I put this lever on that, that is done. Destroy all this so there's no issues. I hope you're ready for perhaps the greatest thing you, you're ever going to see. We're going to perform one hell of a scientific experiment. All right, it should be making lots of TNT every time I hit that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, the neighbors are gonna hate me. Yeah, every time we whack it, just drop some more TNT. Yes. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. All right, if I have done my calculations correctly, I have made some changes. I'm acting like I'm the smart one, bro. I followed a YouTube guy. Oh, yeah. We ain't stopping till we hit bedrock, baby. We duplicating TNT. We've blown up the world. We're going into the Earth's crust. Oh, wow. Okay. Apparently, it sends them off randomly sometimes. Uh, we have to be cautious of that. So the idea behind this is, yeah, it's like an automatic digger. You can uh, set it up so it, like, travels around. Uh, we're not quite a bedrock. Let's keep going. <laughs> Let's keep going. Oh, yeah. This is worth it after that coral grind. I spent, like, an hour looking for a sea plant. This is absolutely worth it. Uh, so yeah, it's like a relatively simple thing to build. Now I've got coral. It takes me like maybe five, 10 minutes to get everything. Mate, we could, we could put these anywhere. I kind of like, I don't want to die, but you look over the edge, you can kind of see bedrock. Uh, if I had a slow fallen potion, I'd go down and check it out. Right, I'm going to leave that there for now. Uh, we might take it down next episode, rebuild it somewhere. Good night, chickens. Good night. Don't worry, soon I'll have a full zoo of animals. You won't be alone. I'm a chilling here with Willy. Uh, I'm going to bed. I wanted to go to like the end cities this episode. It ain't happening because I just got too tired trying to find coral. I want to make sure I can keep my energy up. So we'll do that next episode. All right, belt the like button. 
Use code LASER in the Minecraft or Fortnite item shops. Both games are great. And I will see all you fellas later.